Hi, this is Paul from Wave5Trade.com and this is my daily stock signals video for Monday the 24th of September where I go through just one of our many stock signals for trading the fifth wave from our stock scanner membership. In the membership area, our members get the opportunity to download potential long fifth wave trades and short fifth wave trades on the 60 minute, the daily and the weekly time frame and then we also as a bonus put in there some potential stochastic long and stochastic short trades intraday. I'm looking at long trades today. So in the members area for long fifth wave trades our members simply click on the image and download the spreadsheet. So the spreadsheet for, day, for today looks something like this. I've chosen the 60 minute time frame today, shorter time frame looking for a potential long on one of these signals if you see at the bottom of the spreadsheet you can also see the weekly and the daily tabs concentrating on the 60 minute today and I've chosen EC Eco Petrol SA on the 60 minute for a potential long trade so let's have a look on a chart so I'm looking at this on our wave 5 trade Elliott wave indicator suite for the ninja trader NTA platform it's also available for multi charts trade station and think or swim uh, so first of all for isolating this wave count our indicator suite allows you to isolate because we're not interested in sideways action here so this sideways action over something like 10 or 11 days is no good for us it's not a trend we want our Elliott wave count to start so we've chosen I've chosen the lows here during the 7th of September we've got the print of the one the two the three and the four on our Elliott wave indicator suite and this is what we're interested in this big move up on the wave three and I'll pull back against on the wave four so let's zoom in a little closer there and have a look at that and discuss where our signals have come from okay so as we can see the wave four has pulled back against the main trend over four days four days yep last week uh, we can see the wave four's found support with the double bottom really in our amber zone. This is our pro high probability zones here and our amber zone represents an 80% probability. If this holds and moves back up it will find a new wave five high into our automated target zones up here in blue. Middle of the zone there is around about 27.30. Now the wave four behavior is very important. We measure that with our 535 oscillator. This is between 90 and 140, as you can see here. Uh, it has crowned, and we did come slightly down again on the last hour of the session on Friday. Also, the stochastic, the yellow dots at the top of the stochastic here denote a very strong bullish trend. We have pulled back against there in the oversold zone and crossed over we've done that again right now so we are on last chance saloon if you like we have to turn up into today's session but with trading you've got to have that and if or when type of attitude and you've got to set these up this looks good if we get above 2545 so that's the high of Friday here you see we gapped up and then just sold off the rest of the session and then formed a double bottom the previous wave for low from Thursday so good double bottom uh, strategy here would be go to be going above the pivot uh, we're also outside of our 64 moving average high the green moving average here on our Elliott wave indicator suite above the high and the pivot really of Friday so 2545 entry long for EC on the 60 minute and then the stop loss down here around about 2464 below this wave for low we got a slightly higher low there but technically this is a double bottom with that uh, doji forming on the last hour on Friday what we're looking for now is a gap up and a move up and, th and through the high of Friday into our trade so that's it today it's a really simple trade setup here this may not happen it may go lower but we've got to get these ready the, these these potential setups after this really great wave four pullback finding support in our, in our amber zone we've got to say to ourselves right if it does go through friday's high we're way outside of our six four moving average high all the other ducks are in a row this is looking good for a trade all the way up to around about 2730 so this is a risk reward of one to 2.5 intra target zones here. So that's it for today. Have a great trading day. Speak to you all tomorrow.